What's up guys, Salty here, and welcome back to another video. So today I'll be starting a new YouTube series, which you already know what it is probably by the title. So basically the idea is that I have a dollar, and by the end of the series I have to turn it into a hundred dollars. I got this video idea from Just Beanie and Ryan Trahan, and you probably already know who he is, because he's the one who started this whole turning a penny into a thousand dollars thing. So there's a couple of rules for this challenge. Rule number one is that all of the profit I have to get that $100 has to be made from the dollar I had originally. For example, I can't go out and buy a bunch of candy bars and with my own money and then sell them to friends and put that towards my $100. I have to work my way up from that original dollar to get to have enough money to buy candy bars. Rule number two, if I'm selling to any of my friends or family, I can't tell them that I am doing this challenge because then they would help me out and like buy it. It has to be like an actual transaction. But I think that's it. I'll fill you guys in if there's any other rules during the series. So I'm probably going to start off with buying something from my brother or my mom. But I can't tell them what it's for otherwise I'll break the rule. This is w episode 1 of turning $1 into a $100 challenge. Here's a dollar and I'm going to go try and buy something for my brother. Cooper, come here. Yeah? Uh, are you still selling those? Come here. Are you still selling those wireless headphones? Yeah. How much are these? Five bucks. Is he a dollar? That's all I have. Fine. Okay, go get him. There you go. Mm okay. Thank you. Got the first purchase. We got some wireless headphones. All right guys, so I just got these wireless headphones right here and I'm gonna text some of my friends to see if they want them. I'm gonna sell them for $2. All right guys, so it's been like 10 minutes. My friend texted me back and he said he'll buy them for $2. So now I'm gonna go meet him up tomorrow and yeah. All right, so it's the next day and today at school I gave my friend the headphones and he gave me $2. Now we're at two bucks. We've doubled what we've originally had. All right guys, I just forgot to record it, but I'm here at an arcade and I just won this little plushy guy from a claw machine and I paid 50 cents of that two dollars. I'm gonna try to sell it to like my brother or something for like a dollar. All right guys, so I got home from the arcade and I used 50 cents of that two dollars I got from my friend to win um, this little stuffy from a claw machine. I spent 50 cents first try I won. And then also uh, there's another claw machine and it had candy. And I didn't win this, it was just already in the chute. Someone didn't grab theirs, so always take the chute, I guess. But yeah, tomorrow I'm gonna see if I can sell both of these to my brother for a dollar, because I only paid 50 cents for them. Okay, so I got the dollar for my brother, but I didn't want to film it because I felt like he was getting really suspicious because I kept buying and selling stuff to him. So I didn't want him to like catch me filming him. Now on to the next transaction. Okay, so I'm gonna see what my mom's favorite candy bar is and then go buy it for 89 cents and then see if I can sell it to her. Mom, what's your favorite candy? Reese's peanut butter cup. Okay, how much will you pay me for to go get your Reese's? Like a regular two cup one? Yeah. Um, like a dollar twenty-five. Okay, that works. All right, so we just went to the store and I got my mom a Reese's peanut butter cup. So now I'm gonna go sell it to her for a dollar twenty-five. I got this for 89 cents at the dollar store, so we'll make a little bit of profit. Mom, huh. I got your Reese's. Yes. Dollar 25, right? Yep. Okay, let go get it. Here you go. Thank you. Thank you. This one. <laughs> so now our total is $2.86, and I asked my other friend uh, what is his favorite candy bar, and he said Kit Kats. So I said if I bring you two Kit Kats tomorrow, we'll how much will you give me? And he said he'll give me $2.50. So yeah, I'm gonna go buy two Kit Kats each for 89 cents and then go and give them to him. So I gave my friend the two Kit Kats at school today, but I couldn't film that transaction and the headphones transaction just because it's at school and I'm not allowed to film. But yeah, I'll try to film as many transactions as I can. He gave me $2.50 in coins here, and so now our total should be $3.58. This is the last thing I'm gonna do today. So I asked my grandma if there's anything that she needed from the store. She said that she needed some Oreo Thins. So I asked her how much she'd pay me to go buy her some Oreo Thins, and she said she'd give me $5. So yeah, let's go to the store and get some Oreo Thins. Okay, 
we got the Oreo Thins, and now let's go over to my grandma's house so she can buy them. There you go. Thank you. Thank you. So I've kind of been running out of ideas of things to do. So I just asked my grandpa if there's anything he needed from the store. And luckily enough, he wanted something that was in my price range. He wanted a bag of Tostitos chips. So now I'm gonna go to the store to get them. And yeah, see you at Walmart. Okay, so editing Salty here. I realized, I just realized I never filmed me giving my grandpa the chips, but yeah, I got them and he gave me five bucks for them. All right, so I decided that my next plan was to go to GameStop and buy some used games. So the games that I bought are, are gonna be up here on the screen. Um, I posted them on an app called Let Go. It's like a buying and selling app originally. But then uh, my friend, like he like looks at my Legos, so he said that he wanted to buy them and it's the same friend that bought the headphones. So I sold those to him for $5 each. I got them at GameStop for $2.99 each and plus tax and all that. It costs like $6 and 40 something cents, I think. And I had like $7 and 60 something cents. So I got that and then made ten dollars back and i gave him the games at school so again i couldn't film that so i just added it all up and our grand total for the end of this episode is eleven dollars and 22 cents so from a dollar we've gone to eleven dollars and 22 cents but yeah sorry guys for posting this video so late it took a while to make and also i've been working on uh, another pretty big project which will be my next video that i hope you guys will enjoy but thanks for being so patient on this video I've been traveling a lot and make sure you comment, like, and subscribe and turn on post notifications so you never miss an upload and I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace.